Good evening and welcome to BBC News. With me, Patrick Johnson and... Me, Martin Johnson. We're late, by the way. <laughs> Tonight, headlines say that the Human Torch was denied a bank loan and that, well, a lot of banks have been going corrupt on top of that, which I can understand a bit. Right? You got any news for us today then, Martin? Yes, the crazy woman that strangled herself in the bath. Really? Crazy. Wow, there's some crazy people out there, isn't there? Now let's go over to Sunnyside Village where I'm half asleep. Good evening. I'm Arthur Sleep, and I'm in the town of Sunnyside in the south of Yorkshire, and I'm seeing what the village's reaction is to the water board's plan to build a dam in their village. So now we're going to take a break while we go and see what the villagers have to say. Thank you. So, Good evening, welcome back. I'm in Rory and Mandy Jones' house. I'm going to see what their reaction is to the plan. So, Rory. What's your reaction to the plan to build a dam in your village? What plan about dam? So while they're talking, let's, I'm going to ask you, the viewers at home, if what are your views? If you've got a very bad say, please text in, text flood to 6336. So what was the question again for us? What are your views on the plan to build a dam in your village? Well, it doesn't really bother me because the business is going down and there's not much around here, so it doesn't really bother me. And Mandy manages the house, so... So Mandy, where would you go? What would you do if you had to move out? To be honest, I have no idea. No idea. So that's it. Join us after the break when I'll be talking to some other villagers. Alright, start. Welcome back. So now, I am in Sunnyside Community Park. So we're going Ten to talk years. to this lovely old lady here. Excuse me, will you keep it down? We're trying to do a TV interview. Thanks. Sorry, well, don't mind us. A second again. Five, four, three, two. Good evening. Welcome back. I'm now in Sunnyside Park. So now we're going to talk to this lovely old lady about what she feels. Hi there. So, Ted. If you move, what memories will you leave behind? A lot of memories. A lot of memories. So, what memories in particular will you leave behind? My daughter. She's got a daughter, so how old is your daughter? She's dead. Oh. Huh. So, uh, that's, I think we'll leave that there. So, uh, yes, so join us after the break and we'll, we'll be going to a pub to talk to Billiger, the bartender and council representative about his view. Thanks. <laughs> So, welcome back. Now, we're going to go to the Red Lion, a very nice pub in the middle of Sunnytown. So, this is Billy Joe, the bartender and council representative for Sunnyside. Uh, so, Billy Joe, what will happen if the village is moved? Well, I'd get in business. He'd get out of business. So, what would happen to you? What would happen to the villagers? Well, I reckon, right, I'd have to move out and I wouldn't, I wouldn't be in council because I've moved. And, and, uh, wouldn't you be able to be the council again on, on the other one? Um, we'll see. Mm -hmm. So, what would happen to your pub? I don't like that. What would happen to your pub? I don't like that to me. What happened to your pub? I don't like you. Okay, let's leave that there. Thank you very much. So, join us after the break when we'll be going to the church. All Saints. Thanks. God, this pub's full of it. Retarded. Stop counting! Stop! Yes. So now, we're going to go into All Saints Church here in Sunnyside. So let's follow me. This is Judith, Judith Margaret Taylor. Hello. She's a helper here at All Saints Church. What would happen to the church if you moved? I don't know, to be honest, but it'd just go. But like, so many people have got memories here, and it'd just be like really, really downing. Really downing. So, what would happen to the Jesus and the Virgin Mary and everything here in the church? They can't go. They've got to. They, they can't be destroyed. So many people love the Jesus. Just look at that. Just look at that. So, what would happen to the 
church? Would you move to a different church or would this church? I want to stay here. I don't, I don't want to move. I want to stay here. I, I love church. It's my church. I don't know it's the reverence, but I, I, I belong here. Okay. So would you be upset if you had to move? Okay, let's leave it here before we get upset. So, there we have it. This village struck by a tragedy of the water. Could you move, please, mate? Sorry. Step aside. Struck by back. a tragedy. What's going to happen? No, thank you. Yeah. What's going to happen? Six by ten, yeah. Next, yeah. tomorrow, cool. what we're going to happen is. Hi, Mum on TV. Ten. We're working. Tomorrow, what's going to happen is we're going to speak to the water board and get a statement from them about what's going to happen. Thank you. Good night. Take it there.